our web application so what is routing we'll understand first of all so we have three pages for our application right we have the home page we have the department page and we have the employee page so we want to map each of these pages to a different URL so that is nothing but URL uh, that is nothing but routing so what I'm trying to say is if you look at the URL if I say slash department and click on enter I want to land into the department page and if I type employee and click on enter I have to land into the employee page so that's nothing but routing so in this video we will learn how to implement routing in uh, react JS so we'll stop the server because we have to install a dependency called react router DOM so let's type react router DOM <clears throat> so we have uh, the second link which is react training dot com so we'll go to this and we have to install it using this command M npm install react router DOM so let's copy this and uh, let's paste it in the node.js command prompt it should be npm install react router dom let's click on enter so we have installed react router dom now let's restart the server by typing in pm start again meanwhile when it start we are going to make the changes inside our project so the first thing that we want to do is we will we will have to import three components from react router dom which is import react sorry browser router and route <coughs> and finally switch from react router dom let's save that and see if there is any issue there is no issue so let's proceed <coughs> we'll remove this and we have to wrap the entire div content in between the browser router component let's do the same <coughs> And that is done so next thing we have to write is we have to write switch
and in between switch we have to write the routing logic right so I have to write route <coughs> so if the path is equal to slash which means the root folder it has to map to the home page right so I'll write component component equal to home and we have to write something called exact okay and then let's map the department page <coughs> so path equal to slash department so this will map to the component which is equal to department okay and then finally we have the employee component and the URL which will map to it will be employee <coughs> so that is done now just try to test this so we are in the home page uh, it has to recompile department <coughs> okay so now we are able to navigate so I have written slash employee here and we are able to navigate to the employee page but the home page should be this yeah welcome to home page employee management portal this is the home page so this is the home page and if I write slash department it will navigate the department page and if I say employee slash employee it will navigate to the employee page <coughs> okay so that was all about routing